Alright everybody, welcome back to EKG. My name is Paul, and we're back playing more Rainbow Six here on Isle Isle. And wait, what was that? Wait, what was that? Oh, I'm about to show you guys my next project. I've been building something. That's what these floor lights are for. Uh, you guys saw floor lights in my pocket last time, and I've been building a stage. I, this one I probably actually should have showed you guys at night, because these lights uh, kind of look cooler. But I'm building it right now, so you guys can see it in construction. Uh, I had all this stuff in my house earlier, but I have it out here now just because I needed more room and I thought this might be a cool idea. Because then you can get every once I have people in my town, I can bring them over and fucking set up a stage down here and get some cool music going. Ooh, there's another fossil. Hell yeah. I'm going to put this shit down first. I've got these floor lights. I have them alternating white and red because they're the only two colors I have. I might think of something different to do after. Alright, so white and then just got to get the final red down. Oh, really? Okay, you know where I'm. what I'm trying to do here. Come on, get with the picture. There we go. Alright, it's starting to come together. And see, I use these, uh... See, this is kind of like the back of the stage. I'll give you a tip. This is actually the rock climbing wall, if you want to copy this idea. This is the rock climbing wall. You just turn it around, and... Literally, there's no way you could see the back of the rock climbing wall, even if you tried. So, like, there's no way anyone can tell. It basically just looks like a big stand-up wall that you can... You can use this, I this idea for anything, so feel free to steal this. Um, I thought it was pretty clever myself. Now right, we're gonna go get this fossil. We'll find out what Blathers thinks of these, see if they're any good. Even if I have them in the museum already, I can maybe put them on display. I'm trying to get a, uh, Plesiosaur and a Mammoth. I'm trying to collect those fossils just for display. Because one of them is like a giant brontosaurus looking thing, and it is like massive. And oh, it's Draco! Speaking of dinosaurs, he's a dragon. Are you out for a walk? What up? <laughs> Isle Isle's the perfect size. Too big to see across, but too small for a sea monster to attack. See, this guy knows what's up. He knows what the real threats are. Uh, do I have something I could give him? I don't want to. Uh, I'm not going to say that, and then. Oh, okay, see ya. <laughs> see, I didn't want to, like, look in my inventory to see if I had something to give him and then say, nope. Because that would have been mean. So I left those rides going. Hopefully that's safe. Just leave that going. It's fine. Ooh, balloon. Hell yeah, the balloons are exciting again because none of them are the fucking bunny day balloons. Alright. Just gotta make sure this doesn't land in the river because I have done that before and it's very sad. There we go. All right, let's see what that was. Baby bear, oh my God, I'm selling that. I'm so sick of getting baby bears. It's like just a little teddy bear that like just kind of awkwardly sits and looks creepy as fuck. Right, let's see what Nan's up to. I'm gonna harvest all these trees later. It doesn't make as much money as you'd think it would. I guess maybe I'm just into the turnip market now, so I'm just used to that kind of money, but. Oh, she's not crafting, but she's eating a donut. Again, she won't put the horse mackerel away. Please, just stop showing my shame. I'm so sorry. If you didn't watch the early episodes, I, in the early days, I gave all my villagers shitty fish, so that way I would get rewards. And it, I learned my lesson. It's a bad mistake. I hear you were busy around here yesterday, kid. Oh, she knows how much I played this game. <laughs> Getting the most out of a day? Oh boy, she knows how much I played this. Uh, last night, I didn't get this on recording, but she was over at Boone's house at like 1am, which was a little suspicious, but... You know what? I, they let me in, and they were like, we're having fun here. And she even said that she was there to read romantic novels, which I was like, okay, this is, uh, you know what, you guys do you. I'm happy that you're happy. Uh, but maybe, I, I don't know if I need to be here. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, another fossil. This is the fossil app. I said the last episode was, but... This one just ended up being it. Canberra or Bam, are they home? Nope, they're out and about. We'll see them. Canberra was in the museum last time. Well, there's Bam. Bam is my favorite. Bam is my BFF in the town. He's my OG villager. Muscle madness! Yo, he's working the abs. His neighbors were complaining. Oh, his only neighbor is Canberra, so Canberra was complaining. Oh, she's got a fossil in her front yard. Hope she doesn't mind. I'm taking that. Could have been donated by Canberra, but it's about to be donated by me. Sorry, Canberra. I also noticed I have a random rose in your garden. I'll have to fix that later. Because that is bothering me now. Alright. 
Ooh, one thing that you should always do daily as well. Ooh, I'm gonna catch that bee. Thought I was gonna let that go. Ooh, and there's two paper butterflies over there. Okay, I did actually let the bee go, so I'm sorry about that. But these are worth a thousand each, so you shouldn't let these go either. God, I'm telling you, the, I, I've been saying it all three of these episodes. The, the bugs are out in full force now. I mean, I love the cherry blossoms, but oh, I love this bug onslaught that I'm getting. All right, let's see what's going on here. I haven't stopped in here today. Green delicate blooms wall. Whoa, that was in the garbage? Awesome, you guys, check your garbage. Sometimes you get some cool stuff. Get my daily bonus for signing in. I usually sign into the terminal just to see um, what the song is. They sell you one song every day. KK Stroll, I don't think I have that one yet. So I'm always gonna check that out. Anything good here? Usually not too much here going on. Oh, the Animal Crossing new, oh shit. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> this was like a pre-order bonus for anyone who had that version of the Nintendo Switch. It's 35000 but I'm buying that. I'm buying that. I don't know when I'm going to see that in here again. Garden Lantern's nice, but I do have one of those. That's awesome. Sweet. See, I didn't even have to buy the special Switch. I got the thing anyway. Shows you guys. <laughs> Just cost me 35000 bells. Which is really... I don't even know if I'm going to put it up, but... In this game, you never know when you're going to see furniture again, so I recommend just buying it. Not to see no bird at the terminal. See, I, 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 there was a bird at the terminal last time, so I didn't see this message that was left on April 6th by my uh, buddy Ben uh, Sanchez over in Sunnyvale. He got abducted by the UFO and was able to leave this warning note. I haven't seen him since, so hopefully he was okay. He did say his rear was a, t a tad sore, but aliens are known to do that. So watch your butts. Alright, I think I, yep, I have all four fossils, so we can go donate these and see what they're, what's up with these. See if we got anything cool. Oh, Merengue's out there catching bugs in the middle of the city. Maybe not the best place. Uh, I'm here in the middle of the day. Usually he's awake because I'm playing at night, but... Oh, I had to wake him up. Hoo-hoo! <laughs> I love that every time. Alright. Four fossils. Four chances at something new. Okay, at least something. Let's see what's up. I can't really see what they are until I can check my inventory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, blathers. You do kind of blather on. Alright. Okay, only one of them is new. Okay, have that. Iguanodon and a Parasaur. Okay, those aren't very cool. Ooh, shark tooth pattern. Okay, that's pretty cool. I'll donate that. Shark tooth pattern. You see, I have to say yes every time because I just feel so bad saying no to this wonderful little owl boy. It comes from the lower jaw of an ancient shark of the genus uh, Heli Helicorpion. Its teeth seem to have grown in a distinctive arrangement, rather dis disturbingly termed the tooth whorl. Oh, God. Oh, that's interesting. I never knew that. Sharks are never preser preserved as fossils because their bodies just... They, they don't stick around. It's not bone. Interesting. But the teeth do. Oh, see? Blathers teaches his stuff. It's nice. He's got a nice little fucking museum here. Be nice to the owl. You, know, you only wake him up once a day. Take all your fossils in at once. Jolly good. Alright, we already saw the museum, so we will leave. Still a fresh day, so there's still stuff to do here. I only got my one furniture from the tree. I haven't even looked at the oceans yet. I'm catching bugs. I mean, I gotta go sell my bugs quick, because I'm mean, racking in the bug money. My turnip money is uh, not looking great, but last time I ended up selling at my buddy Ben's house. He's the one who got abducted by those aliens. And I, uh... Or so sold it in this town, I should say. And I got a he was selling for 600 fucking bells each. Made 500k, so that's where the money is. Alright, gotta be careful selling this shit. Don't really care about that. Baby bears being sold. Sell all the bugs. I can sell that tree that I'm for some reason carrying. Nursery coconut. Yeah, sorry, I don't need any more coconut trees. Yeah, sell those. This is just stuff I'm carrying. I don't know why. <laughs> 
Taylor tickets. I still haven't used that. I guess I'll hold on to that. Alright. I think that's it. Yep. Oh, 23,000. God, the bug market is strong. Nice. Ooh, this door frame is cool. Skull door plate. I will take that. Yes, please. I didn't notice that before. Only 540? That's a deal. Also, I like checking out to see if they have any interesting flower seeds or if they have any good wallpapers or whatnot. Red rose, red tulips. Oh, no, nothing really that exciting today. Ooh, nothing really exciting here either. Well, not a good showing today, Nooks, but that's right. You try your best and I love you. They had to kick me out of the store last time because I accidentally was signed in too late. And so I was in the store for like an extra 10 minutes and they were like, please leave. <laughs> You <laughs> kicked me out. Let's see what Marengi's up to. Oh, actually, I, already, I talked to her already, but she's being nice about it. And she's trying to catch that bug, and I interrupted her. Come on, go for it. Go for it. Come on. Get it. Get it. Do it. I know why they don't try to actually catch the bugs. It's because they, they don't want the game to steal ga bugs from you, but it's frustrating watching them just struggle. <laughs> just fucking stalk them. In the night. Yeah, I got this as well. Nice. See, the plaza's coming together. I, I, I said I wasn't going to build another bridge, but I did cave. Because I needed... This was just convenient to get to my house and to get to this other section. Eventually, you end up building stuff just for convenience. And, ooh, another bumblebee. It's my favorite song, I think. KK Ballad. And not my favorite. Good. Oh, KK Western is probably my favorite, but this is the top three for sure. This is probably the best one for, like, villagers to sing, I think. So I like to let it play outside their houses, so that way if they are singing a song, they sing a good one. Speaking of good ones, I wish I had a good villager in here, but I have a guy who says, Durr, like an ugly duck. God, he's terrible. I'm so sorry if he's in your town and you like him, but that one just did not work for me. Oh, I haven't been down here yet. I haven't found a message in a bottle. That's one thing I can keep my eye out for. And the fish are all good right now. No more uh, fucking... Well, that one's a horse mackerel, so... I'm gonna catch it anyway, just to... See if maybe I'll be proven wrong, but I'm 99% sure that's a horse mackerel. I'm gonna promise not to give it to one of my villagers. Yeah, it's a horse mackerel. I should just not grab those. In the nighttime, it can be a barrel eye, so... Do catch them after, like, dark, but right now, no. Not worth it. That's another one. See, I'm going to learn my lesson. I'm going to walk right past it. But there are red snappers out here, and I'm going to find one. Or if I'm lucky, I'll see a big fish on the pier coming up down here. Oh, hell yeah. Speaking of lucky, it's my boy Gulliver. If you wake him up, he'll give you a quest to, uh, to get a free piece of furniture. You just got to wake him up. You just got to keep talking to him until his ass wakes up. <laughs> Almost, almost. He don't give up. He'll wake up. There he goes. I was about to start hitting him with my shovel, so I'm glad he woke up. <laughs> yeah, I'm the one who jabbed you awake. I was about to jab you awake. See, I think in the original game, I think I heard that he was like, he washes up drunk on your, on your beach, which I think is what they're going for. He's like the drunken sailor. He ends up losing like the parts for his cell phone all over the beach. Yeah, look at him. This guy is a drunk. <laughs> it's not handy dandy or dandy. Alright. So you, the uh, communicator parts are hidden in the beach, kind of like the, the shells are. The ones you use for fishing. No way, you can say. Well, that would be a dick move. No, I gotta help him out. Oh my god, please stop talking. I know what to do. You've washed up on my beach like four times already. Alright, get our shovels out. We have a new mission. We're going to pull that weed. Not going to let that be. Got to take care of those pronto. See if there is a pure fish, though. No luck. All right. Do I think I heard one. Yup. Oh, I missed. Yup. All right, I got one. Only need five. Ooh, that could be a red snapper. Oh, Draco's about to cheer me on getting this red snapper. Oh, I missed. 
Ooh, the concert hall kind of looks cool in the background there. Liking how that's coming along. Got to be quiet when I do that. I like to use the ear method. Oh, that's a squid. Damn it. You never know if you don't try. Pick up these shells. Ooh, that's another gull off the part. There we go. Nah, you know what? He doesn't even give me the piece of furniture right away, so it might not be that exciting for everyone to see me finish this. Uh, we will be back for more Animal Crossing next time. Join us. Now, nah, you know what? He doesn't even give me the piece of furniture right away, so it might not be that exciting for everyone to see me finish this. <laughs> and I just got another clam. So, you know what? We're going to end it with the Zen. End it here at the bamboo. Get a nice little hello and a nice little how do you do? Goodbye, everybody. <laughs> uh, we will be back for more Animal Crossing next time. Join us.